This video is sponsored by Osmo. I'm a little nervous about our first day of toy homeschool. Are you guys? Me too, Addy. I'm absolutely nervous. I hope it's as fun as our normal toy school. Me too. I wonder what our teacher would be like. What if she's boring and makes us do math worksheets all day long? Oh, that would be a real bummer. Whoa! Hello kiddos and welcome to class. It's time for our day to begin. Let's see, here's what I'm looking for. Where did she come from? We'll begin with our first class today, which I like to call Little Genius. What is happening here? Colin. That's me. You're my first pupil, so Addy and Maya scoot from there to here, and Colin from there to there. Whoa! Yay, I'm first. How did we get over here, Addy? I have no idea, but I think today's going to be a lot of fun. Okay, Colin, to begin, you'll need Osmo's Little Genius Starter Kit. Yes, it is quite amazing at instilling a love of learning through imaginative, hands-on play. Now let's get it open. Now we'll attach a device. Did you see that, Maddie? Incredible! We'll begin our class by practicing our letter recognition skills with a little help from the ABCs game. You'll need your play mat as well as these colorful squishy sticks and rings. I want to play with those. Me too. Now Mo the monster will guide you through your lesson. I love Mo. Hi there. Mo the monster here. It's so great to see you. Hi Mo. Tap on one of the magic letters. Presenting the letter L. Can you make this letter? Here's how to make the letter L. First, place this piece down. Then this piece. Magic time! Here's what you made. Yeah! What an amazing show! I'm so proud of you! L is for ladder. Let's make the sound for L. It sounds like... Oh, 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 oh. Let's turn that word into a picture. How would you create a ladder? Can you clear the playmat and create a ladder? Here's one way you can create it. Okay, now to pull it in. Get ready, keep your hands away from the plane. Magic time. I love what you've created. If you're happy with your creation, tap here. And if you'd like to try to... Phototastic. It's like magic. Speaking of magic... Magic hat. Feeling awfully hungry. I'll add a letter A. Magic wand. Abracadabra. Apple. Ooh, one letter left to go. Presenting the letter R. Can you make this letter? Place this piece down. And finally, this piece. Stand back and hands up. Okay, be ready. Magic time. Here's what you made. Yay! Let's make the sound for R. It sounds like Silly Mo. 
Well done. Let's turn that word into a picture. How would you create some rain? Can you clear the playmat and create some rain? Yeah. Here's one way you can create it. that way I know right that would have been so much more fun okay Colin it's time to shift gears and move on to costume party a costume party we will be needing these <gasps> Wow! but you will need your costume pieces you'll be experimenting with colors and clothes to dress characters for an epic color filled party yay I want to go to a costume party Ah. This person wants to dress up for a party. Here it is. Ah. Pink. Ah. <laughs> cool suit. Here is it. suppose she has in there? I don't know, but let's find out. Photo props! We're going to our own costume party after all, Maya. I want to be a princess first. I want to be a Viking. Come on, let's pose together. Selfie time! Let's do some more. Check out this helmet with a cat on it. I'm going to be a mad scientist. <laughs> Selfie time. Cheese. Sunglasses. And I'm gonna be a pirate. How do I look, Maya? Epic. How do I look? Arrgh. Awesome. Time for selfies. Cheese. Ah, 
the little genius class period has ended. Already? Time flies when you're having fun. On to our second class, Math Wizard. Colin, it's recess time for you. Addie and Maya, huh? take your seat. I will never get used to that. It's like we're in a science lab now. A science lab? This is definitely not a science lab. It's a potion lab. A potions lab? Oh dear, I am definitely not dressed appropriately for math wizard class now, am I? I'll be right back. There, that is much better. Oh, but oh dear, you two are dressed all wrong. We're gonna need to fix that. Here, push this wizard hat on my little one. Okay. It's a little bit big, but it'll do. Whoa, I got a wizard cake. And you're officially a math wizard. Now it's your turn. Oh, okay. Ready for your hat? There we go. Do I get a cake too? Whoa, I got a purple cake. Cool. And now you are both math wizards, which means our potions class can officially begin. Wow. Now time for a demonstration. What do you think she's going to do? No idea. There, the consistency is perfect. Now girls, just time for the magic words. Pink and sparkly glittery glue turn into a magical poop. Perfect. Wow, what is that? Why, it's unicorn poop, of course. Unicorn poop? And it's absolutely scrumptious. Mmm. Ew. Ew. No, really. Help yourself. Go ahead. Mmm. Mmm. Yummy. <laughs> Why, of course it's yummy. But now it's time for you two to start creating your own potions. But how do we do that? Well, let's go back to your table and I'll show you how. Come on. Now the first thing you're going to need for a successful potion is Osmo's Math Wizard and the Magical Workshop. Wow, math series? Learn through hands-on play? Addition and subtraction? Now let's get it all set up and add the tablet. Wow, magical things inside. Look, there's a postcard, Addie. What does it say? It says, Dear friend, thanks for coming to Waver and Dora. Help me run things around here. Jungles and I could use a hand at the potion shop. And I need some help getting dragons off the ground. There's a ton to do. Please come quickly from Mumbles. Wow, it looks like we got a lot to do, Maya. Okay, girls, you're going to need your mixing mat, your sticker sheets, your spell book, counting cubes, and counting rods to start brewing the most magical potions. Eek, I can't wait. Now grab your dragon claws and magic sparkles and start mixing potions. Dragon claws and magic sparkles? I don't know what to mean, but let's play potions. Oh yes, welcome to Wivendell. And thank you for coming. Now, double button out here is our potion shop. Oh, we're in the potion shop, Maya. I ran it for many years. But I've recently put my nephew, Jumbles, in charge. Jumbles? We read about him in the postcard. Uh, Jumbles, uh, come on down and show our guest around. Well, he, he'll be down soon. I'm off to the castle for a little cat nap. But you two should have a nice, quiet day together. Toodaloo. Uh, please help me. Everyone is in trouble. Oh, oh no! no. Oh, they all turned tiny, and I'm not sure why. Oh, I have a lab for making potions, but I keep messing up. Can you help me get everyone back to normal? Don't worry, we can help you, Jumbles. Here, I'll show you how to make a grow potion. A grow potion?
There we go. We'll need a dragon claw and an eyeball to make a grow potion. I think we have to help that giraffe grow. To make a potion, we have to add ingredients into the machine. Yeah, the dragon claw and the eyeball. There, now our mixing mat is all ready. It looks like we need one dragon claw and two eyeballs to make our potion. Let's add them to our mixing mat. Now one dragon claw and two eyeballs to make three magic sparkles. One, two, three. Now we get to make the potion. Look, I think it's working. Our grow potion works. Hmm, a little bit of this or a little bit of that? Oh, my stinky potion is a success. Mm, I just love that stink. Oh, wow. Do you smell something? Yes. What is that horrific odor? Isn't it wonderful? <laughs> no, it's absolutely not wonderful. What's in it? Frog legs, rotten eggs, spoiled trout. <sighs> oh, no wonder it reeks. We'll have to plug our noses while we create our next potion, Maya. Boy, you two have no appreciation for a proper stinky potion. Okay, Maya, it looks like this guy's in need of a shrinking potion. Okay, let's look at our spell book. Here's how we make a shrinking potion. It looks like we need mushrooms and feathers. Okay. Oh, the smell's died down a little bit now. You're right, thank goodness. I'll adjust our mixing mat. All right, mixing mat is ready. We need six mushrooms and four feathers for this potion. We can do this together. equals 10. There are six mushrooms. And there's the four feathers. It's working. Potion. Those could be interesting. What else is there? A light potion and a shadow potion. Well, maybe we should see what Jumbles needs help with first. No, that can't be. We were just getting started. Ah, I'm afraid Math Wizards class has come to an end. Time for dismissal. <gasps> wow, Whoa. she did it again. And Colin's back. Our school day is now over, children. No! Now, I'll be leaving you with your homework. Homework? We don't want to do any homework. Toodaloo! Wow, 
Check out all of those other Osmo games. This is the best homework ever. Yes. Oh, this is so right. A coding starter kit? I want to do this now. Look, it's Mickey Mouse and Flint. That's so cool, Colin. I want to check out this detective agency. You get solve mysteries around the world? Ooh, I might be playing that with you, Maya. Or we do math wizards and the secrets of the dragon. Oh, that looks super cool. It's a practice everyday math measurements. It's pizza! Oh, Colin, you found Pizza Company. Become the big cheese of your own pizza company. And check out the Super Studio with Frozen 2. And there's a Genius Starter Kit with a family game night. Seven games for ages 6 to 10. So who's ready for homework now? Me! This video is sponsored by Osmo.